Hey guys, it's Mike Malave, your realtor at Preferred Real Estate Brokers here. And today I'm going to show you these beautiful townhomes being built by Dean Ash that are three bedrooms, three and a half bath, over 1,800 square feet with a two car garage just south of downtown Orlando. Thank you very much as well to Scarlett and Heather from Anchor Real Estate for giving me a chance to showcase their listings. Now, before we get to it, if you do want to see more of these properties, I do have other videos as well available for you. Please comment, like, and subscribe. This is a beautiful property, and let's get to it. So just entering the front door, you're walking into what could be used as a third bedroom or office space, like in this setting right here. This is the entryway of your townhome. You can see right here, you're entering right off of the street. You do have a supermarket directly across, tons of restaurants you can walk to eat to, uh, even desserts across the street there too, if you can see that. Um, but this entryway does have a full bath. There's double doors here which could be made closed or a single door to make it more of a bedroom. But you can see how this is a great third bedroom and it also comes in off of the garage. Yes, these units have two car garages. Um, there's 15 of them, but every single one does come with a two car garage. If you missed it earlier, this is a three story townhome. Take a look here. Tile work nicely done throughout. Nice flooring. I really like these windows here. These windows, this one alone is maybe about four feet long. <laughs> and look at the front. Definitely give you that city vibe, that city view. Nice light coming in. And as you enter too, the ceiling goes all the way to the second floor. Now I'm gonna take you guys up the second floor where you'll see the main living space, the kitchen, and the living room. Now that we're up on this second floor here, you'll see, like I mentioned, you have your huge kitchen. Even though it's a townhome, look at this huge kitchen here. You do have a half bath in the back, as well as a pantry. But as I spin you all the way around, you get to see this is your dining room and your living room area on your second floor. Even views from the kitchen of the other buildings in the south downtown area. This corner unit is just sweet because it gives you that many extra windows as well. That additional natural lighting is so great. Now the floors that we're walking on are the engineered wood laminate flooring looks like to me. You do have all the stainless steel appliances. Crown moldings at the top. Even the drawers are soft clothes. And even for the bigger drawers, they actually have the pullouts shelving basically giving you all those extra conveniences that people are looking for these days especially a new construction home even the larger doors are soft closed as well nicely upgraded stove with a beautiful hood tons of counter space to be able to cook or even eat out with friends extra deep sink like I mentioned before you can actually use this counter as like a bar top you can eat breakfast here you can just sit and talk with the kids in the morning still have enough space for your dining room table this dining room table seats six and you could possibly squeeze in a few more seats here and then you have your living area 
You can either put a television where that, fo that photo is on the wall, have a large sectional or separate pieces for your seating area. Now remember when I walked in and I showed you how high the ceiling was, that is the reason why you can see all the way up. They have a nice little, I call it peekaboo window. So you can see the guests that are coming in downstairs. And like I said before, beautiful views. You have your supermarket right across the street, but you still have tons of greenery. So it's not like you're only looking at buildings and you're not the only homes here. Now, this is the third floor I'm going up to. And like I mentioned, here you will find the additional two bedrooms and additional bathrooms. One will be the master, one will be an additional secondary bedroom. Take our way up the stairs here. They did match the floors here on the staircase along with the flooring throughout the townhome, just to give you that seamless look. Now, I know you wanna see the master, but I'll show you that last. Making your way up to the third floor, you do have your laundry closet. So your washer and dryer would fit inside here. Um, open up this door for you so you can see. Your laundry space up here, so you don't even have to bring your laundry downstairs where your guests will be. You just take it right over here and put it right back in the room. So this I would call the secondary bedroom. This being a Cornita, once again, taking full advantage of these huge, beautiful windows. Beautiful windows with this lighting coming in and you can open them to get fresh air if you wanted to in some of our cooler seasons. Here is the full bath for the secondary bedroom upstairs. Nice tile work done. And again, you have another window in the front. Tons of natural lighting in this town home as you look all the way around. Don't really need the lights on all the time like I have right now. But finally, here we go. We got your master bedroom. This master bedroom is a true master. This is not a tight, squeezed master bedroom. I'm gonna stand over here, and where I'm standing right now is where the closet begins. So I'm pretty much standing in the closet. That is a king-size bed, for example, for you right there. Have a dresser, two nightstands, and still have space to have additional seating and tables in the same room. Just to give you a size example, this is like a six foot mirror right here. So this is not a small master at all. The master does come carpeted, um, so it's nice and soft, but you can always change and make a tile if you would like to. And this is your master bathroom. Dual vanities. No bumping elbows here. Your private space is off to the left. <laughs> and you have your full shower in the corner on the right. Again, with more natural lighting, cut out, and the handle on this side so you can turn on the shower without getting wet right away. I know that's something that kind of bothers me in the morning. Take you guys back out. I'm gonna show you the closet in the master. Here's your master closet. You can add additional shelving. This space here, I would say, is I mean, more than enough for two people to share. But really, look at this master size. So I have to just show you the size again of the master just because you're living close to downtown Orlando. Technically, they call this Soto, south of downtown Orlando and you have a huge room. Remember when you think downtown areas, you get small spaces? That's not true here. You have a full-on master suite. 
I want to say thank you so much for following me throughout this entire home tour. If you made it this far, I really appreciate it. <laughs> um, if you do have additional questions, like I mentioned before, please feel free to reach out to me. You can reach me at 407-630-8484 and ask for Mike Malave. I'll be glad to answer your questions and show you anything else in this area that you may want to take a look at. So then guys, peace.